I'm trying so hard to remain calm because the bottom line is I don't know who these people are and these people don't know who I, I am. The only difference is I'm on here in all my glory, showing my face with nothing to hide. Let's, like I said, let's let's do the same on news. Let's let's do a deep dive on news there. Eh? Let's see if you've got any skeletons in your closet, eh? So I've just been looking back at the chat last night because I don't always pay attention to the chat when I'm on a panel. I don't sometimes I'll have a glimpse of it and see certain things, but then when you see again the judgmental, faceless characters there are, I just have to turn the chat off i can't look at it but i've just been looking at it back today and this is what i'm saying some people are just absolutely vile they really really are spouting accusations about a situation they know nothing about taking the anger and the frustration out on people who it's got nothing to do with and they haven't got the first clue yeah and like I said, I can explain it till the end of time. And these people have, as I've said in my previous videos and whatnot, these people have already made their minds up. Yeah, these people have already made their minds up. So these two people here, for a start, these two people here, this one saying you won't answer a simple question. You won't answer a simple question. No, the problem is we do answer it. You just choose not to listen to it because you've already made your mind up. So it doesn't matter what I say. You're not going to hear the true fire. You're not going to listen to it. So, like I say, I know I've got nothing to hide. I know I haven't done anything wrong. You, can, you clueless, faceless people mean nothing to me and can believe whatever it is you want to believe, yeah? But this person here, this person to bring somebody's child into a situation makes it a million times worse makes it an absolute million times worse makes you equally as bad for bringing someone's child into it yeah so for a start as i said last night in the panel i do not know this person the only association i have with this person is for, that we are from the same town we are from the same town, that is it. I met up with him about once for all of about 10 minutes when we turned up somewhere to film something, yeah? It was covered head to toe and I knew nothing about him, yeah? This person, you know, this comment, this comment, yeah? Anyone would think I've asked this person to babysit my child, Anyone would think this person's hung, like I said on my live the other day, yeah, if you want to go and check it out to listen to what I actually had to say on my live then, anyone would think I'm inviting round, round this person to babysit my child. My child, one, do one daughter by the way, not daughters, one daughter, so that's where you're wrong on that. My daughter has never met this person, ever, yeah, so get that fact right my child has never met this person yeah and like i say i've met him the once for all of about 10 5 10 minutes yeah that's it yeah so if you want to punish me because we come from the same town then fine spew all the accusations you want i don't know this person as for this person sharing my video again when she, once you upload a video, I don't, I'm not sure if you understand how social media works, right? Not, sh not sure if you do, but as for someone sharing one of your videos, that's an option, yeah? I upload my, vi once you upload a video to social media, anybody can do anything with it. I can't force anybody, I've said this before, I can't force anyone to watch my stuff, I can't force anybody to share my stuff or not to share my stuff. Yes, if I get, sometimes now and again I'll get a notification saying somebody's copyrighted your stuff, yeah, it'll pop up on my app saying someone's copyrighted and I can decide whether I want to fight that or not, yeah, because, you know, if someone's blatantly using one of your videos to, you know, and it's copyrighted, I'll get a notification for that, 
yeah? I've had none of that, yeah? So what? This person shared a couple of my videos. So what? Does that make, make him my best friend because he shared a couple of my videos? No, it doesn't, yeah? People can share your videos. There's the option below the video that says share. They can copy the link and put it on whatever website they want. That that's that, that's what happens when you put a video. So I, I'm not in control of who, and I don't. I quite frankly, I really don't care. I'm. I know. I go out as I say. I create videos, upload them to YouTube, then they're out of my control. Yeah. Taking your anger out on me isn't changing anything. I understand you're mad at the situation. I understand you're very mad at this person. Go to the right places and do something about it. I can't do anything about it. It's not on me. It's not on my shoulders. It's not up to me if this person is or isn't on YouTube. Right? So go complain about it to the right people. Do something more productive than frustrating, taking your anger out on people it has got nothing to do with. Yeah? Like I say, he's not here. I know I, I he's not in my house. I, I, I even I, I, I couldn't even say if over the past year or whatever if I've even walked past him or not in the street. Do you know what I mean? Because again, he walks around head to toe covered, just like he did that day when we when we went out. He turned up somewhere to do some filming, and he was there with somebody else. I think I, sp I, I we had a conversation for, like I said, all of about five minutes or so. That was that. I didn't, it was covered up. So I couldn't even tell you what it looked like because it was covered up that day. So, like I say, you know, I have no association with this person or any other person. I've not talked to anyone. I've not done anything in the past year. I'm somebody that focuses on my own channel, doing my own videos. Right? I go out filming by myself, yeah? Okay, in the past, yes, I've met up with a couple of people, done a bit of filming with other people. Now, let me ask you this as well, right? Let's just say, for example, Jamie, Society X, yeah? As good as a fellow as he is, got found out to do something. Got He got caught doing up to no good, whatever, pick your own crime, whatever, yeah? He got found out to, have, some skeletons on him have been pulled out of the closet and he's been found out to do something, yeah? You've been in his chat talking to him. You've been in his chat talking to him. Does that make you involved? Does that make you as bad as that person? Because you've been in that person's life talking to him. Eh? If, if Jamie gets found out to have committed some sort of heinous crime. Yeah. Oh, but you've been in his chat talking to him. You've been on his panel talking to him. Does that make you involved with that person? No, it doesn't. Social media is filled with thousands of people. Some good some bad i keep saying this the good ones like i say show themselves in all the glory with nothing to hide right the bad ones will get found out and will that they'll fizzle out as we've found out people on this app have come and gone over the years i'm still standing strong and i'm still going to continue to do what i do stay in my own lane focus on my own channel so you judgmental assholes out there Get a grip of yourselves and go take your frustration elsewhere because it's got nothing to do with me.